This is a short video tutorial showing you how to open InDesign to set the document um, measurements so you can have millimeters, centimeters, or inches, um, and then add columns to your document. So if you don't see InDesign in the bottom of your dock, what you need to do is go up to the magnifying glass at the top and you'll see that I already typed in InDesign but we can just type in I and N and it comes up as my first option. Just press enter and your screen should look like this. Now before we even say create new document, if we want to change the ruler settings to millimeters or inches or centimeters, what we need to do is go up to InDesign in the top left hand corner and go to our preferences. You'll see that we get a whole host of different options, but what we need is the units and increments. You can see here that on the ruler units, which is what's important at the moment, is that we've got horizontal and vertical a set to millimetres. Now, some of the video tutorials that you might watch will be working in inches, so we can easily change that to inches. You can't change these preferences once you've started working on the document. So then we press OK. We create a new document. And we've got a few settings here. We can change the orientation of the page to landscape or to keep it on portrait. Um, and then we've got different page sizes, A4, A3, A5 and so on. Um, and then here we've got columns, so we can introduce a few columns. So I'm going to just make three and press OK. And you can see that on your page here you have three different columns and a little bit of a space in the middle. That means that the text won't sort of butt up against each other and just look like a sort of a mess. Um, if you want to add a new page, you just go up to Layout, Pages, and Add Page. And if you scroll up, you'll see that the columns appear on both pages.